everybody, it's your boy Moski, back with another video. Today's video is a reaction video to Cody Rhodes and Seth Rollins confronts the bloodline. So this is a continuation of what happened last week, Friday Night Smackdown, when we had a whole segment with The Rock, Roman Reigns, and the whole bloodline. And the main part was The Rock issuing a challenge that he said he wants to have the biggest tag team match in WrestleMania history. It'll be The Rock, Roman Reigns, versus Cody Rhodes and Seth Rollins. So he issued a challenge, so we're going to see what is Cody Rhodes and Seth Rollins going to say about that. Are they going to accept it? Most likely they will. <laughs> and that will most likely main event WrestleMania Night 1. And yeah, I'm excited to be honest. If that actually happens, oh, I'm, all, I'm all for it. I cannot wait to see that match. But before we continue with the reaction, I would like you guys to do me a big favor. Please drop a like comment and subscribe it really helps this channel out grow and gets my video out there to the public so i really appreciate you guys do that for me and without further ado let's get straight to this reaction all right here we go <laughs> what is seth rollins wearing <laughs> he's like he looks like he's a highlighter <laughs> what the him and his freaking wardrobe, man. Obviously, you have offered to have my back against the bloodline. It's kind of hard to take him serious, too, with that outfit. Even with a bad knee, you were there then. You keep saying you're going to be there as we move forward. The plot has been incredibly twisted here. I didn't even think I would be on WrestleMania. Wasn't until I saw that stupid PowerPoint presentation about how Rock and Roman's family was. Oh, it's about than the bloodline tree. And I decided I have to make a change. <laughs> I have to Rollins. go back on my word. It was my right. I won the Royal Rumble. I get to challenge Roman Reigns. You, you, coming off of injury, you have to face. The only other guy who has pinned me in this ring besides Roman, Drew McIntyre. I was shocked when Drew McIntyre pinned uh, Cody. Because Cody doesn't get pinned that much. So. So I was like, whoa. <laughs> what I am saying and what I wanted to say here and in person for all the world to see. Rock and Roman Reigns together. Two Mount, Mount Rushmore wrestlers together I fully understand if you want to focus on Drew and you are not on board with having my back okay Cody's giving Seth the out like hey man you don't want to do it because you got a title defense on yourself because you got to defend your belt I understand <laughs> Well, I respect you giving me the out. I'll take care of Drew McIntyre, all right? Okay. I told Drew last week, I told you, I told the entire world, there are some things bigger than us, and taking down the bloodline is the biggest thing that we can do. All right, set the standing on business. Because... Because it's not just your story that needs to be finished in WrestleMania, Cody. It's my story, too. Ten years ago, Roman Reigns and I, we came into here together. We wanted to take the power from the top. I wanted to take the power and give it back to the people. Okay. Roman Reigns wants to keep all the power for himself. And here's the problem. Here's the problem. We're this close because with the rock in the bloodline. Ooh, was that a this close to Roman Reigns? Was that a symbolization of what the rock did? Because remember, he always throws up the, and he was, and then you see Seth. He was like. Oh shoot! We're gonna talk about that at the end of this video. We're gonna talk about that. That was just a a little hint at something. I don't know. We'll see. We'll talk about it after this. Like I said, chanting "Rocky sucks." <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Rocky 
does suck. And, and look, he ain't been the rock for a long time. He damn sure hasn't been the people's champ for a long time. So you know what? I think, I think I'm just not going to call him these things anymore. I was thinking about it. Over the last week, I figure I come up with a new name for The Rock. Let me let me try uh -oh. this for a size. I think I'm going to call The Rock. Hmm. It has to be something creative, man. If you're going to insult The Rock. <laughs> How about Diarrhea Dwayne? Really? single thing that comes out of his mouth has the consistency of wet baby poop. Oh my. What, what are we, like five? <laughs> the That's the best insult you got? Now. I don't know. Now the fans are chanting diarrhea. I just... I felt like Seth, whoever gave uh, the script to uh, Seth Rollins, they could have given him a better promo and a better insult to The Rock. Because diarrhea, really? <laughs> it sounds like San Antonio agrees with me, eh? Because The Rock's on Instagram for 21 minutes. Are you serious? And this guy has the gall to get on there, insult your dog, and he says he can make the World Heavyweight Championship go away. He says, with a snap of his fingers, because he's my boss, he can make it go away. Well, Rock, I dare you to try. And, get this, guys, I don't know if you heard him, because 20 minutes is a long time to listen to that idiot, but he said... He made professional wrestling cool again. Oh, yeah, The Rock. The Rock, our savior, guys. He saved us. He made it cool. Diarrhea Dwayne, I don't know if you know this or not, but you ain't been cool in 20 years, pal. <laughs> okay. But I'll tell you what is cool. This morning, I received 100% medical clearance. All right. I Seth Rollins is ready to go. I am ready to go. And so this Friday, I will be at SmackDown to confront the bloodline. Okay. <laughs> oh, shoot. All right. So what I want to know from you, do you have mine? No, well, we know the obvious answer. So yes. <laughs> Even the fans are, are chanting yes. <laughs> so Seth officially announced that he's going to be on SmackDown. Well, to answer your question, I guess I also have a message for the rock rock it's been a long time since you haven't just been handed something i think it's been since you had that seven bucks in your pocket and i think you forgot the people's champion is not in perpetuity rock I am not the same man as you. I'm not going to whine in a 21-minute promo. I am coming to SmackDown with oh, Seth shit. Rollins. I am going to stand across from you, Roman Reigns, <laughs> the wise man, the whole bloodline. In the great state of Texas. And this Friday, I will give you face-to-face, eye-to-eye, not whispering in your ear, my very clear and obvious answer for what's happening at WrestleMania. Okay. So we're going to get confirmation Friday Night Smackdown this week. I cannot wait. I cannot wait. Okay. So... <laughs> 
we, we got it official. So Seth Rollins and Cody Rhodes are going to appear on SmackDown. And they're going to confront the Bloodline and obviously the Rock and Roman that they're going to accept their match. I thought we we're going to get it today that they're going to accept it. But like, no, nah, they want to drag this this whole story all the way to WrestleMania. So it makes sense for them not to like obviously confirm it right there. They'd rather do it in front of their face. So I cannot wait for that promo. I know it's going to be a fire promo out of both people, Cody Rhodes and Seth and uh, Rock and Roman. Well, Seth, for this promo, man, what the, who gave him the, who gave him those, uh, the script that, to read those lines of what he just said about Dwayne. I like, you could have came up with a better insult than that. That was like a, like a five-year-old wrote that. <laughs> but let me get back to the topic of what I was talking about in, uh, when it happened during the promo with Seth, when he did this. I was like, hmm, he, cause he looked at himself and he looked at his fingers, he was like, and then he just continued, you know, carrying out with his uh, promo. I was like, oh, is is there something that we don't know? Is is there something that Cody already told Seth? Like, what's the plan that The Rock is working with him? He's being this inside man to sabotage Roman Reigns and the Bloodline. Because remember, when you see The Rock doing it, he always every time he throws up the ones, he always does it like this. But then he did it recently where he closed it. I don't know. I, I, that's what I'm saying. I'm not saying it's going to happen. I'm saying it's my theory of what's going to happen that The Rock is going to portray Roman Reigns. Not at night one. Night one, my prediction for night one, The Rock and Roman Reigns, Roman Reigns is going to win. And night two, that's when The Rock is going to interfere and cause uh, Roman to lose by having the bloodline not help Roman Reigns where Cody Rhodes finishes his story. So... I'm calling it that, and I think that's going to happen. <laughs> Let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. I'm excited, and most definitely you guys are going to see a video of the Friday Night Smackdown promo out of me. So I cannot wait. Well, if you enjoyed my reaction, please drop a like, comment, subscribe, post notification, get all my videos up to date. See you in the next video, and peace.